Hey fashion lovers, welcome to the Fashion Try-On. If you want to support our channel, please be sure to like and subscribe. Today we're unboxing and trying on the latest Bad Bunny Adidas Response CL collaboration. This sneaker has previously come out in a few other colorways, which include beige, black, yellow, and even a really cool green. This latest colorway is actually in a brown, which Adidas characterizes as a colorway that evokes the arid tones of the land with a palette of browns in various shades and touches of deep purple. Okay, getting a first look at our box here, we can see it is a very luxurious box. You have the Bad Bunny signature icon of the eye and even some embossed textures to make it feel next level. The box opens with an easy slide for easy access and reveals a really cool dust bag with again, the Adidas logo as well as the Bad Bunny Adidas logo. Okay, before we move on from the box, we did notice that there were some numbers inside. It looks like it might be a manufacturing date and maybe an item number. We couldn't confirm this online, but if you know for certain, drop a comment below so we, so we can all be a little more informed. All right, back to our shoes of the hour. So the dust bag does come with a very sturdy drawstring. So, you know, even if you don't wanna store your shoes in this dust bag, it would be a really cool bag for other organizational things or just a different use. Okay, getting a first glimpse at our shoes. Um, they do come wrapped in a Adidas tissue paper with neon yellow Adidas symbols. Taking one more look at our bag and then we'll put this one away. It is pretty simple on the inside and the back of the bag, but good to know. All right, moving back to our shoes of the hour. So again, taking a look at the tissue paper, it's a little strange that they just came with one tissue paper wrapping both of them together. Typically these would be wrapped individually, so it's a little bit easier to pull them out of the bag without ripping, but an interesting style choice. And now looking at our shoes themselves, we do see that the outside and the inside of the shoe are a little different. So you get a little bit of this coral tan color on the outside of the shoe. Um, while you only get the purple on the inside. I think that's a really interesting or unique touch to give a little bit more diversity to the shoe. Nonetheless, we can start to see that throughout the shoe, you do get that terrain type of inspiration that we heard about a little earlier in Adidas's description. So not only with the colorways of the multiple shades of brown, but also with the placement of the design and the placement of the browns, it really does give kind of a terrain shoe or a mountain climbing shoe vibe, but it is still a sneaker. And I think the purple and the corals just make it pop overall. You can see that you have the purple on the tongue as well as inside the shoe, you have the um, Adidas as well as the Bad Bunny logo. And then of course, a unboxing would not be complete if we didn't show you all of the tags. So these are all the tags that you would see up close um, that you oftentimes don't see on you know, just a regular listing of a purchase to buy. So we do wanna give you that transparency and see exactly the experience that you would get if you were purchasing this item yourself. All right, back to the shoes themselves. Let's make sure we take a look at the bottom of the shoe. So while the top of the shoe and the sides of the shoe are a little bit more subdued in their color, on the bottom you do have a lot of purple. So this is where you really get that accent color really upfront and personal. We can see there is a little inscription on the bottom. We see one for Addy Wear and we also see one for Torsion System, which I guess is the type of um, sole that the, the shoe features. If you know a little bit more about this or the benefits, please do let us know in the comments. So again, we can all learn together. All right, let's go ahead and have our model try these on. So taking a first look at popping these on, the shoelaces come untied pretty easily. They are a standard shoelace. Something I did find interesting was that we did not receive extra shoelaces with this um, collaboration. It would have been kind of cool if we got, you know, maybe a, a pop of coral to accent the outsole, um, but it does at least have the purple color, that purple pop of accent color along the anglet at the bottom of the shoelace. So that is a plus, um, but let me know if you are surprised by this um, not having additional shoelaces as well. So taking a look at these on the foot, excuse the um, styling choice with the sock color. Of course, you would probably wanna go with maybe a white or even honestly a beige. I think that would look really sharp. Now getting the other shoe on and we are going to test these out. So upon first try on, the comments were that these are actually very comfortable shoes. 
Now I do think that's something really important and especially with something like a sneaker, it is just made to be comfortable. Beyond comfort, we can see that these shoes are pretty sharp. Um, I do know that they come in a white colorway or a green colorway, which got very hype. So I wonder if these are going to take off just as much as those. Let us know in the comments below what you think. As always, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.